In its 11th year, visitors were in awe as floral ballet illuminations imaginary inspired by the Australian botanical environment danced across the famous cells of the Sydney Opera House. I think it's fantastic, actually. Uh, I'm a, I study architecture, um, and just looking at the Sydney Opera House is like one of my you know, sort of bucket list items, and then seeing it like this is it's really remarkable, honestly. The facade, a custom house, projected life under the sea while a dazzling ballerina lining installation captivated onlookers in front of a fluorescent Sydney Harbour Bridge. For me, the colour. The colour and the vibe and everyone coming together, I think that's really special. It feels like Sydney's awake and Australia's awake and everyone's here. So. It's a good theme. It's you know we've been through a lot in the last week with <laughs> different themes and different topics being brought up left and right. But this one feels right this year. It's colourful, it's vibrant, and it's fun. Yeah. The festival will run for 23 nights, ending on Saturday, June 15. According to Vivid Sydney organisers, the live festival was attended by 2.25 million people in 2018.